Welcome to today's edition of the show podcast. See Comics has just confirmed that Nightwing is one of the greatest forces for good in the DC universe, and it's addressed in the most touching way. In the latest issue of DC Comics Nightwing, a new era has begun for Dick Grayson in the city of Bloodhaven. Having been out of the game for a few years due to injuries, Nightwing is finally back in action, ready to help anyone in need. Likewise, it's just been confirmed that Nightwing is one of the greatest superheroes of all time, and that particular confirmation comes from the most touching and heartbreaking source. This new era for Nightwing comes from the all-new creative team of writer Tom Taylor with art by Bruno Redondo, fresh off their run on Suicide Squad. After a flashback to the past, Nightwing is seen patrolling his city in the present, something he hasn't done in a while as he was shot in the head a few years ago by the mercenary known as the KG Beast. Due to his head wound, Dick Grayson lost nearly all of his memories, leading to him leading a whole new life apart from Batman and his family, going by the name of Rick. However, the events of the Joker War in Gotham lead to Grayson getting his memories back. Now that the dust has settled and a rematch with KG Beast has taken place, Dick is finally ready to make his return as Nightwing in earnest. However, one of the saddest things that came from Dick being Rick was the fact that he was essentially another person when the Bat family's butler Alfred Pennyworth died. Now in Nightwing No. 78, Taylor and Redondo give Dick the closure with Alfred that he missed out on. Barbara Gordon visits Dick and reveals that she was the executor for Alfred's will, and he shockingly left his billions of dollars in savings to Nightwing. However, the insane amount of cash also comes with a letter from Alfred. In it, the man who mentored Dick just as much as Batman shares just how proud he was Nightwing as a hero, but also how much he believed in Dick Grayson, the man behind the mask. In a particularly touching line, he also shared his great hope for Nightwing's future. As if this wasn't touching and heartfelt enough, Alfred ends the letter by telling Dick how very proud he is to call him his son. Taylor and Redondo need to be commended, not just because of Alfred's belief that Nightwing can be one of the greatest forces for good in the world which in a world of heroes is saying something, but also for giving Nightwing some incredible closure that he missed out on due to being Rick. As such, it provides one of the best and most intimate moments in all of DC Comics, elevating Nightwing in such a dynamic and engaging way that one would have to be robot to not choke up at least a little bit by the end of Alfred's letter. Billions of dollars aside, Nightwing is now able to venture into this new era stronger and better than ever before, receiving the ultimate vote of confidence and declaration of faith in his abilities from one of if not the most influential person Dick Grayson has had in his life. As such, Nightwing fans should be incredibly excited to see what's next for the series from DC Comics.